Hello YouTube, this is a long, long, long overdue video. Uh, I usually have the washer or dryer running and I think of an idea of something to say and I realize that it's too noisy. And the only thing I expect of noise today is perhaps the people doing the lawns. But mostly it's quiet here, and since I'm by myself, it's really quiet. And since I don't talk to myself, except now, it's pretty quiet. But I just did something that um, was a bold step for me. I sent a message to a governor, and I let him know a, a little bit of my history, but I mainly sent this because it was just announced on the TV today that he had lap band surgery in February. Perhaps you know this man because when S Sandy, that hurricane that hit, um, Governor Christie and President Obama shook hands even though they belonged to different parties and that was a bold step for him but as people started questioning him not only about Sandy and politics and all people started asking him about his weight and if he were to run for president in 2016 Perhaps he should think about losing weight. And I know that I've seen videos where he said, I'm healthy. And that's not something I want to do, referring to weight loss surgery. But he actually was in the mix already. Because I learned that he had it in February. And, yeah, well, anyways... Maybe somebody put that idea in his head, or maybe saying no, because sometimes we say no or back off, but we rethink, and we think and think and say, hmm. So I, he must have researched it and found a good doctor and had lap band surgery. So what I did was send him a little message, and I also mentioned the Weight Loss Surgery Foundation of America because my message was to invite him to come to Las Vegas in May. Yeah. Did I make a bold step there? But another bold step is I'm asking you, oh you shrinking violets, even if you're male. <laughs> but, you know, sometimes we hide behind our excess weight and we don't make bold steps. Oh, my heart cried when I finally got to watch Mandy's video. And I, I understand because I worked in the public eye. I was a letter carrier. I was out there. And, well, I was out there, and many of the people that I worked with felt it was okay to make remarks about my weight, especially if we had a function where the postmaster provided food. Once a fellow would say, come on, come on, come on. And knowing that it was just donuts or bagels, I wasn't even going to go in the room. I wasn't eating bagels and donuts. I had determined that I was losing weight and I was up for weight loss surgery. I don't eat bagels. I very rarely eat donuts because it's a lot of It doesn't it doesn't fill you up. It might gross you out, but it doesn't really 
give you the nutrition you want. And another thing. Yeah. I wasn't exactly healthy. I would get sick all the time. You see my nose now? It gets red, but it's not from a cold. It's from that special nerve you have in the your body that's called the vagus nerve. And it seems if I eat, take my vitamins, swallow a protein steak, even open the refrigerator, I mean, really, my nose wants to run. So I'm awful... Awful. I'm often putting something on my nose. But let's get back to the subject. The subject is, I am inviting you to go on to Facebook or make a YouTube video and invite Governor Chris Christie to come to the Weight Loss Foundation of America meet and greet this May. Not too many more days, and I'll be there, because I'm going to be there on Thursday, May 16th. I'll be there at Bally's by noontime, I expect. So look for me. And forgive me if I don't remember everyone's name, even if I see you on Facebook or YouTube, because I'm going to be 66 soon. Yes. No, I just think I just do not have that facility to remember names. Well, I do enjoy you and I will remember some things about you, but if I forget your name, that's just me. So, I hope to see you in May and think about what I just suggested, please. Bye-bye.